PVT would like to say hello to everyone. This is the afternoon news. Ghost Factory promotes films with a male lead duo, so it promotes films by Ta Chen, Cha Liang and Yangs. Traffic at the Ghost Factory plummeted during this time, and viewers flocked to kill a fruit next door. The broadcast of Storm drew a frenzied nationwide audience, capturing almost every market and leaving only a small backlog. In order to recover from the decline of the platform, Ghost Factory carelessly promoted the two-star drama League of Gentlemen starring Jing Boren and Song Wee Long. To demonstrate the advantages of the platform, 10 episodes were released at once in an attempt to create another prosperous world for the two male protagonists after Chen Kingling and Shen Ling. There's also not a lot of people discussing this movie, because the series has a lot to do with how it handles plot removed broadcast comments, just that the current results are too mediocre. Above. However, films with male participation have been banned for a long time so it is difficult to regain popularity in a short time, entering the market is also not easy, aggressive marketing only causes problems. How many good films do you have in your hand, you must be better than the gentlemen of the alliance. Not sure why it's not working? Zayao's hands two dramas can be funded, and Wu Lei's work next year can also be funded. Zayao's Han has always been known by the nickname Son of Goose Factory. In 2019, he became famous on this platform and then realized a deep cooperation. Basically, all of Zayao's Han's dramas are related to Goose Factory. Zayao's Han's current inventory Dream C and Yugo IO are the main S class projects on this platform. It is said that Yugo IO is difficult, the costume verification of the film is very strict and many changes are required, and it is still in the verification process. Ghost Factory isn't stupid and won't give up the power of this movie. What I don't understand is that Dream C has successfully obtained a distribution license and is allowed to use Ghost Factory for broadcasting, and Storm needs to be dealt with. I am difficult to understand. Co-star is Lai Duong, this time has acted together five times, the audience and friends are all looking forward to it. In addition to Zaya Oz Han's film, It's Just Love starring Wu Lei and Hao Yutong has a distribution license and can be broadcast live. It also prevents the fact that it is classified as morning and evening in the first quarter. There may also be historical dramas trio led in and Duong too. Ghost Factory also has a good collaboration with two famous actresses Yang Tsen Tru led in. The community projects are all period dramas they specialize in, which is a sharp tool for gaining popular traffic. Yang Tse's historical drama is Long Sik, with Han Guan Ai, Den Wei, Tan Jiang Si, and more, and the cast is pretty good. It took a long time to finish filming. If post-production is okay, send it in for review and arrange shipping as soon as possible, the traffic will be visible to the naked E. Zha Liang's historical drama is Walk with the Phoenix, and the co-star is Hayashi Kenshin, the second co-star after The Legend of Chu Kao. The play was completed last November, and in the intense production that followed, all I can say is that the play was born at the wrong time and not always operable. But Ghost Factory will surely reap huge profits if it airs in the second half of this year. Recognition was very high at CCTV Spring Festival Gala. Ghost Factory is two Zayao's hand dramas, Wu Lei's drama and Zha Liang and Yang Zi's drama, which can be broadcast. Thank you all for watching PVT Express News. Goodbye everyone.